Roseanne Barr on um, nuclear family, man and woman, and how to raise family and what she wanted for America. Don't uh, kneel, you know, stand tall, and, you know, don't disrespect your husband either. You know, be a team with him to raise better kids. That's yeah. So don't be a slave, but don't be a master. Be a team player, cooperative, but, uh, cooperation. They don't like that. Women didn't like that. Women, uh, but I feel like they were led there. They were told, uh, oh, you can do it all. You don't need a man. So, you know, they have all these kids and they have no jobs. And, you know, the, and then they struggle forever and their kids struggle too. But nobody would tell them, you can't have it all. You can't do it all. You can't do it all by yourself. No, either. it's right. going to be really hard. Yeah, and you need, and you need a guy. You need a man in the house because he's got to lay down the law. Not you. You don't even. You can't lay down the law. You're hysterical half the month. Right. Nobody wants to admit that either. But the man, he has to be there, steady and even, to keep you know loving the woman when she goes nuts. He's got to be like steady and even with it. Women need that balance, and so they took that away from them. And look where it went. They're all half out of their effing mind, and they're ruining everything. Screaming about, you know, you better, you know, just censoring everybody like witches. Like a cabal of witches. It has gotten witchy. Yeah. And it's like... And it ain't the right kind of witchy either. Right. Because witchy, that's like, you know... You're casting a spell, a good spell with words to make people wake up or think. Everything's a spell that uses 